this week on Lo Lobos. Do you ever um, get nervous about being out in public? That's oh, yeah. Always I don't my... like to film in public. Okay. <laughs> because, like, whenever we do it, we're always like, just put on 0.5 lower the phone. Let's go. <laughs> oh, really? Let's go. Let's go. Really? <laughs> I do know a couple girls have IBS. There's even billboards for it. Sabe que tu corazón conmigo se hace It is. brought you a stack. Aren't you the guy from TikTok? Delete. I can't. Say Scotland. Scotland. Right there. Hey, there you go. Hey, right there. <laughs> I kind of was that Lewis Capaldi. Three, two, one, go. Come on, come on. Come on. All right, shall we do this? Eh? It's eleven right, eleven right now. All right, let's get started. Eleven. Let's 11. start right now. Make a wish. Is that what I you're supposed to do? All, All right, my pop charts come warm. Let's do it. You can't. It's too it's too short. Welcome to this week's episode of the podcast. Hello. Good morning. Um, wherever you are, thank you so much for listening. I am one half of your host today, Sholom Duenya, joined by one third. Whoa, one third today. You're right. You're yeah. right. You're right. I'm tripping. Uh joined by I am the second third, the raw dog and uh Pop Chart eating half. Um Jacob Scott Thomas Bertrand, joined by our third host, Leo Gonzalez. Leo Gonzalez. You want to introduce yourself? Um, my name is Leo Gonzalez. Uh, Why is he introducing himself? You shouldn't do that on a yeah, podcast, you, bro. You, can yeah. you include Raw Dog in that too? Yeah. <laughs> Our Raw Dogging third host today, <laughs> Leo Gonzalez. Thank you yeah. so much for being on the pod. Thank you. We, we are so appreciative of you coming on. Our first comedian. Our first yeah. real funny man that we've had oh, on the pod. Wow. Oh, For wow. real. No, we're, we're super excited. Leo and I go a little way back. We go way back. We go a little way back to a the few The way that ago. I tell it, we go way back. <laughs> way, way back. Um, um, we've brushed past two ships over, over the night, uh, over the past couple of years. Um, and we're just really excited to have you on the pod. Thanks for coming in. I heard that you came out of town a few days ago, eh? You were in Miami, too? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I was in Miami a few days ago. Yeah, yeah. Do you like traveling? Are you an easy traveler? Um... I'm. It's getting easier now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, you said now that I'm in first. Yeah. Said, it's easier <laughs> now. Oh my goodness. Can I? Can I say bitch? Yeah, you can yeah. say whatever okay. you want, bro. Yes. Okay. <laughs> he's like, yeah. he's like, bitch. I, he's like, I just have to know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Before this podcast, I'm like, starts. I just have to say bitch a few times. <laughs> um, can Isaac? Will you grab me the bag, please? I brought. I brought you guys a gift. What? Oh, no. Because bitches don't bring gifts anymore. Like okay. whenever I see stuff, this yeah, this segment you weren't even gonna bring out the gift if you weren't allowed to say, say bitch. bitch. Yeah, that's yeah, right. yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> I need to reach my bitch quota. Um, oh my goodness, it's a uh, don't get too excited. No, um, we've never had a, 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 a gift, gift, gift on exactly. the podcast. So um, just some stuff I found. Um, so uh, I brought you guys some pistachios. Okay. Uh, these are for you, Jacob. Do you like pistachio? You give me I pistachio vibes. They're from Fresno State, which I know you know oh, Fresno a little sick. bit. Wow. And then these are a mix uh, for for you, a mix of some nuts. Ooh. Um, and, and what then, can you tell us about fancy? Is this fancy California? Uh, no. Fresno, Fresno. Okay. Yeah, I I don't know if that's like I don't know if that's like their brand or something. They're not the ones to shout out. It's Fresno. Yeah, Fres. You got to shout Fresno out Fresno State. I don't know. Fres. Yeah. Fres, yes. Um, I also so brought you guys some Red Bulls and stuff. <laughs> nice. Just you know when you get like PR stuff that you don't really want. <laughs> yeah, Mate. <laughs> I I like some. I'll fuck up. I'll fuck up some Yerba Mate. Not That's not what I mean with this because I love Red Bull and I love Guayaki. Dude, I like Red Bull. I'm down to be caffeinated. Uh, do you have you had these before? No. Oh. No, I don't trust those. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> <laughs> I don't trust those. You're like, oh, uh, actually, that's not my brand. But, yeah, you know. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> is Fresno known for their nuts? Oh, yeah. Yeah, Fresno is. What was that? <laughs> <laughs> nuts? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> Fresno nuts? Yeah. They call it Fresno nuts. Fresno nuts? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Where are all the walnuts and the, the almonds? What in walnut? Oh, oh. No, I'm kidding. I, don't yeah, think I, that, I, yeah. I wouldn't be surprised, though. There is. In Walnut, California? Yeah. Well, thank you so much for our gift. I have to try one um, before we move on. A date? Sholo, this is for you. The Meaning of Mariah Carey, a memoir. <laughs> Dude, he loves Mariah Carey. How I knew that know? about you. It's not. <laughs> and then Jacob um, it is. brought you a stack. Um, 
just for you. <laughs> Is it Mary Poppins bag? Dude, they and look so real. They are. <laughs> <laughs> they are. I need those back. That part wasn't clear. <laughs> no. I thought he was like, hey, show your Mary <laughs> Kay Jacob, uh, here's 10 bands. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and then um, these I just had lying around. Um, I'll sign them for you. Okay. Um, we actually already have one. Oh, and it has your at on it too. <laughs> yeah, I don't know yeah. why. <laughs> <laughs> this is the one that you give the ladies? You're like, here you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This yeah. is my business I card. give that out. You know what's funny? I remember you throwing these out to all of the people at 340. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, when I was blacking out. Um, <laughs> and then I know you guys, you know, do a lot of magazine stuff. So I wanted to give you a magazine uh, from the most important magazine. <laughs> West uh, Hills. Community yeah. College. Uh, West nice. Hills. Um, is this your best alum. friend? What's that? Is that your best friend? This guy right uh, here? No. This is Charles, his best friend. The, yeah, yeah, yeah. Charles. We go so far back. So way back. Um, <laughs> thank, well, thank you for our gifts. Like, yeah. We got to keep is, this up. You bet. We're going to no longer have gifts on the podcast anymore. After that. <laughs> after, the, after that. Because I noticed like people just don't do that kind of classy stuff anymore. I love this. I, I really want to steal this. Like get invited he, to like it's a your, dinner party. Oh, 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 it's like it's yours. You don't have oh, no, to steal it. No, 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 no. <laughs> like if you get invited to a dinner party, you're like the plus one. You don't really yeah. know anyone. And yeah, you yeah. bring these types of gifts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That yeah. would be pretty sick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I met Leo Gonzalez and he gave me a… <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And <laughs> I have his headshot now. <laughs> and yeah, yeah, yeah. And autograph something for me. <laughs> <laughs> Is this your alum? Am I, am I getting this correct? West Hills? Do you have an, yeah. any association to West Hills? Yeah, I went to school there. I went to school. I went to school there. Wait, where where is West Hills? Near Lamore. It's near Lamore. It's in Lamore, near Hanford, near Fresno. And what oh, were you studying? Okay. Sociology. You graduated. Congrats, bro. Nice. Congrats. I Thank didn't, you. I didn't get to make it that far. What's that? I said I didn't get to make it as far as graduating. Well, you know what? To be fair, it took me 10 years. No way. <laughs> what made you… 10 years. What makes you complete it after all of that? Just… Finally, just like, should we finish? <laughs> <laughs> we've, been, we've been here was a it, while. Was it like it's nine funny. and then you took a year and then it was ten? Or was it, was it? I took like seven gap years. Okay, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and, then, and then it was coming, it was cutting close and I was like, okay, I should. I guess I should do let's, this. Let's wrap this up. Because right. I felt like, I felt like those, those people that graduated from high school like two years ago and still come back. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah. You okay, know? okay. And so I was like, let's just finish it. It's let's just, you gave point. a speech. There's I did a, the commencement. There's a picture of you giving a speech. I didn't see that. Wait, can I see that? <laughs> He's like, I need this back. Oh, I didn't even. <laughs> no one should ever see that side profile. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is what I'm getting signed. That's criminal. Is it nerve-wracking to do a commencement speech? There's a lot riding on yeah. the, this, this. I had, well, Obama's speechwriter wrote my, imagine. <laughs> oh, I wish. No. <laughs> No, I wrote it. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know how to do one because I've never yeah, watched what the heck one. Are you? And, What's the formula? Uh, <laughs> and like, I didn't know that you were supposed to mainly talk to them about their stuff. Wait, and I made and it about myself. <laughs> I literally was like, "Yeah, Wait, you was, were doing your set. You were doing your." <laughs> no, I was like, it was hard out here. Like, <laughs> it was, <laughs> like I overcame. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The kids are You're like, welcome. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Sure no, and then if you look, actually, actually, like maybe on the front cover, my my uh, is it called like a tassel? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was on the wrong side. Oh, it is on the wrong no. side. Oh, so you would nobody already, told me anything. You were already Amateur graduated. I I walked. You in, walked in graduated. But you know, I didn't know what side I was supposed to be on. But I came out with all the professors, and they all had theirs on that side. But it wasn't until everybody flipped it that I was like, "Oh, I've already been flipped." But it's okay. You came in as the master. You're the you're the commencement speech. <sighs> yeah. I yesterday I was asked to to do another one, so it feels like it went well. I Whoa. mean, you've been at West Hills for ten years. You better, <laughs> yeah, you better I do. The I owe them a little speech. bit. I took more financially than I should have. <laughs> It's like I got paid to go to school. Wait, so where, where are you going to give the next commencement speech? Well, someone asked me to do it at, at Fresno. Because we are at Fresno oh. State yesterday or like two days ago. Oh, that's… that's yeah. Fresno. That's, yeah. I, I bought those though. They weren't like a gift. <laughs> <laughs> Leo, I was so, I guess, taken aback, astonished, surprised, ple delighted um, at how much improv you put into your sketches, your comedy. I can't do improv. I have never been one to just be like the next. I always go crazy, too crazy, as I'm sure you 
as as we saw the last time that we Your we worked was together. So good. What? Um, yeah, you how do you do you take classes? How do you even? Is it family? I feel like. Were you just born with it? Yeah, were you just… Just born with it. Born having to defend yourself talent. at every… Uh, no, honestly, I don't know where it came from. Um, I think just always trying to like live a lie. Okay. <laughs> and having to defend it my entire Escape. life. We, that's, yeah. what we, that's what we created this podcast on. Yeah. I've noticed that. That's. <laughs> I've watched it and I was like, they're not living in their truth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Every time I watch, I'm like, oh, I hated that. That's what the tarot card said. What and you said, said, sign me up. Yeah. You said, I have exactly the thing. I know how no, to do that. I, I I remember just like DMing. I'm like, please let me on. <laughs> please. Like, I know. I, I, I see what you're doing and I can do that too. You were the third link. We were thinking, mm -hmm. we have, you know, obviously, Jacob has the athletics mastered. Mm. I have the hair. The hair, okay. Yeah. <laughs> and we just needed someone with personality. On I weren't we just talking, Lex? When we were talking <laughs> about that, we were like, "What they need is like entertainment." <laughs> have you? Um, I don't even know what I was. <laughs> I was looking for you. Do okay. you think um, for doing improv? Do you think anyone can do improv, or do you have to? Have no, it? no, what? <laughs> no, no, like, is it something where? <laughs> Someone wants to get in the industry and they want to be funny. They want to be a comedian. Can anyone just hop into an improv class and 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 learn the craft? Or I'm you sure you can. Yeah, I've never. I want to go to classes. Like I've I've never taken any classes, so like I want to learn because I always feel like like I should. You know, I should. But I'm like, fuck, last time I did school was ten years. So I'm like, what if I? <laughs> what if it takes you? What if it takes? What if you're long, 50 man. doing the commencement speech at yeah. the acting school? At yeah, <laughs> exactly. the improv. Um, is no. there part of you that thinks like, ah, what I have is so good right now. Maybe if I go to a class, I'll lose some of the sauce. Oh. You know what I'm saying? No, you know what I'm like, scared of? Here. I'm scared of going to like acting school and like learning that I'm like, oh, I actually wasn't that good. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, but, then, but then once you've learned that, you can be what you want to be, right? Or no? I then it's know. over. I <laughs> feel like my thing is like <laughs> I walk in and I'm going to see and I'm like, oh, no, this is real for you. Because I'm going to meet a bunch of people ah, that like grew okay. up in like theater. Okay. And they're going to look at me and be like, get out of here. Fat fuck. And I'm going to be like, uh, <laughs> like, I'm going to be like, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Like, wait, I, I like acting too. Yeah. But, mm. but that's, that's your fear. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But I think you're good right now. I mean, it seems you seem to have, you're, you're doing commencement speeches. So I don't know if you're on yeah. the downtrend when it yeah. comes to. Didn't you, you just did your first Acting gig, right? How was that? It like, was, was that validating? It was crazy. It was crazy. Um, I think I. Oh wait, you didn't go. Huh? No. Uh, I'm like, oh yeah, I left you out of that. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, it was cool because I had. A, are we good? Imagine. <laughs> I'm like, no. Are we good? Pause. Pause this. Are we okay? <laughs> no, I. Uh, it was cool because that week I had done like a, um, like a, uh, like an like an allergy commercial thing. Can I say that? For yeah. Who? Okay. Oh, you can't, oh say who, you can't say who. Right? Right. Big allergy. Yeah. Big oh yeah, allergy yeah. I actually can't not. say who. I big pharma. Big pharma. Yeah, Those for news. big pharma. <laughs> and um, and so I did that like Monday through Wednesday, and then I did like the show Thursday and Friday. So like that week, you could not. They don't know. Fuck with me. Like, <laughs> I'm an actor. I was like, catch me in my dressing room. Yeah, I was in my trailer. I was like, fuck, my my lunch was. I was so spoiled in that trailer on the first half. Because, like, the PAs were, like, off for everything. And, like, I'd never been, like, I used to be a PA. So I was like, yeah, you get, get that chai for me. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it was crazy. It was it was so, I was actually, like, realistic. I was super, like, emotional that week. Because I was like, dang, like. Is there something intoxicating about it? Is there something that you're like, oh, okay, this is what I, you know, this is my calling? Do you have it? There was, you know, on the first scene of the episode, I sat there. And I had just been, I'd been watching that show. Mm -hmm. Um, and so it and I, you know I've never acted before. Um, and so when I was when I was when I sat down for the first scene, I like looked up at like the main character of it, and I was like, <gasps> "Oh my gosh, like, what am I doing here?" Like I just felt like I just like like tapped on the TV and just like went into this like thing that I had been watching. Um, and I got super emo. Like it took me. I was super like 
like I got like wa- like my my I, I got like emotional for a second, and then like the makeup girl was like, "Are you good?" And I was like, "Yeah." <laughs> you like this? It was supposed to be just straight comedy, and <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're yeah, like, yeah. Is he? Good? He's bringing the mood down, kind of. Yeah, yeah. Like, is he okay? was he the right guy? Do you is think? He- <laughs> and and what is what is different from obviously you've kind of mastered the world that you have. I don't want to say mastered. I'll say it for you. Um, I think you've mastered. I think you've mastered it too. I think you've mastered your your brand, your comedy. How different is it going into a structured set where people are like, "No, nah, the words that I wrote are funny," or do they just let you? No, go off? the cool thing is they let me do it. Oh, oh they let me. Like I remember, like I was like, "I'm gonna just throw in something." Self. Okay, and if they don't like it, then they can tell me. Wait, what's your what's your strat? Do you go in first? Do you do I was one like, of theirs? I'll, no, no, I just oh. did mine. Oh, oh <laughs> off the rip. Oh yeah, 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 God. yeah. Because oh. I was like, I'll ask for forgiveness, you know. Okay. Yeah, like better to ask for forgiveness than permission. And so, like, I just I just said that, like, I took their line, and I was like, okay, cool. And then, <laughs> like, I get the gist. This right? is yeah. a nice inspiration. I, was like, I get where you're going. <laughs> <laughs> you can hone that for me. And um. And then and then and then I said like one thing, and then and then the director was like, ah! yeah. <laughs> I love that. And, and so I was like, did you like? I'm like, daddy, it's just, did you like that? <laughs> yeah. Um, and and so then and then uh, and then we kept doing that. It was cool because one of my lines was uh, fuck. Okay. And that's um, a big deal. There's only a couple of those in yeah, like a series. In each yeah. Yeah. Each like season. it was just. Like it was just fuck. Oh, that was it. Yeah, yeah. Like no it was other just word like a cut to me saying like fuck. fuck. Okay. <laughs> and so, um, wait, can I say that? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. I only asked about bitch. Um, no, no. Yeah, you can. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's weird. Like, Cunnilingus isn't allowed for some reason, but. <laughs> so I. Uh, um. I, I also hate I'm that like, word. I don't feel that's my, <laughs> that's my trigger word. What if, what if he was like a sleeper agent and that was his, <laughs> yeah, that was, yeah, that that was was his really, word all of a sudden? That's like activation. Um, no, but you know, like, and I've never, you know, been on a set before and like, they were just like, if you need any, like, you know, if you forget your line, just say line. And when it was fuck, I was like, line? And then she was like, fuck. I was like, okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just didn't know. I forgot. I thought it was so funny. They didn't think so. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, oh. Do you think you could do something Fincher, like someone telling you dark? for 80 takes? No, this is… Are you ready for that? Yeah, I think so. All right. Jacob, bro, tell me how was Scotland. I've never been to Scotland before. Scotland Was everyone so annoyed? Cool. You're always doing your Scotland, your Scottish accent. I actually didn't do my Scottish accent. Oh, no! Oh, yeah. Didn't keep that energy. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't… There was, there was a couple people that were like… Oh, I love Lone Lobos. Do do your Scottish accent more. I want to like see if it's real. And I was like, okay. So for all of those people, um, are you gonna look down the barrel? And... No, no, I'm not doing it more. Oh I did have God. I did have a girl from from France come up and be like, my favorite episode is when you and Cholo did your French accents. And I was like, oh, were they good? Were they good? And she was like, no. I loved that episode. <laughs> I thought it was really funny. And I was like, you're okay. very sweet. Uh, Wait, Scott did she there. have a French accent? She didn't actually, which is oh, kind of weird. Okay. Yeah. She which just is, liked when you, yeah. She just likes when I do it. So that you go for you. Are you an accent boy? No. No. Mm-mm. Wait. No. Well, now that you said no, I feel like we have to see you. <laughs> I don't have any, I can't do any accent. Really? I can't. Say Scotland. Scotland. Right there. I kind of was that Lewis Capaldi. Are you? <laughs> are like you ready? To be on, I think you're ready for for the Fellowship of the Ring. I think you're. Yeah. I think you're ready to be an elf somewhere. Autumn, autumn. Yeah. That could be you. You down to do some role play? Sco- Put on some, yeah. some elf ears. Have a yeah. bow and arrow. Yeah. Yeah. A little tiefling elf. Yeah. Dude, it would be really yeah. sick if you were Legolas's like twin brother. Who's Legolas? Oh, who's that? Really? Yeah. Nah. You guys are serious. Say the name again. Legolas. Legolas? Is that a word allowed? So no accents for you, eh? No. No, Dude, Canada. Where's the A coming from? <laughs> oh, is that is that a No accent? Is that, oh, he's like, wait, is that Canada? Is that sorry, I'm just so well traveled. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, yeah. Just, Canada? I just <laughs> that's your well traveledness. <laughs> <laughs> I, you know, I was up in I was in Toronto. Sorry, you got I'm back in California. Ooh, where's the Tim Hortons? Yeah. Is there Tim Hortons around here? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Toronto A. Is there some what are those fries called? 
Uh, poutine. Oh, yeah, poutine. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you like poutine? No. Curds? Yeah, I haven't. I didn't like it. But it's it's fine. Sorry. Sorry. Nah, mm, blah. Sorry. Really, eh? I'm sorry. Like, sorry. Eh? What is that? Is that British? No. <laughs> <laughs> you like, I don't want to do the accent. I'm like, sorry, literally, eh? like, I don't like it. Is that right? Oh, yeah. like, <laughs> like, that was that was fantastic. Wait, okay. Man's got got sad bagging on us. All right. Nah, switch it up before he steals our shit. Leo, I have a DM for you. Do you care to explain it, bro? Whoa. Shh, dude, where were you parting, bro? Where were you parting that I got a what text from, was it? from t- at 2 a.m.? Where Come were out. We? Where were y'all, bro? Are you parting? Not like that. Because I remember, I don't remember sending it. <laughs> and then getting a response in the morning. And I was like, because I was like, I don't want him. Like, that's so weird. Like, that's so creepy. What if I was there at like 8 a.m.? Like, I'm here. Where are you? Where? Well, I would have been. Okay, well, let's continue. Let's, go. let's continue. Let's, I don't know where we were, though. We were. Oh, never mind. Ah! Ah! Never mind. <laughs> well, I'm dead. Well, yeah. I just wanted to say that I'm sorry. I, I, I'd never you. I've never been out invited out to the bar like that before, and I was ashamed was when I. I don't know. It was just I, like you know that. why? It's because I think it was the night of something that we can't talk about. Um. Oh wait, can you tell us who your homies are in the room right now? Yeah, um, Alexia Del Valle, she's uh, my Puerto Rican. Uh, I think she's the only one I know. My only Boricua. My no way. Life. Okay. Yeah, which is enough. It's a high honor. <laughs> she's my, she's my Evie queen. see her face right now. That's awesome. <laughs> and, then, and, then, and then I have Isaac Castro here. who uh, he's, uh, He writes a bunch of my skits. Uh, with me, which that explains it. So this is the guy we need, dude. Yeah. All right. So this. I'm is, sorry. I've been here. Wrong guy. What? Are, <laughs> wrong guy. I think, but the only reason we did improv is because we had, had no time to do scripts. Okay. When ah uh, ah uh, uh. okay okay. When you and I did the TikToks because I was in Canada. I was coming back from Canada. Hey. Eh? Uh, <laughs> when I uh, the six, eh? You're the six, bruv. Yeah. Um. <laughs> Like, literally, I was like, I have no time. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, you have like a top. Are you watching Top Gear, bro? What is that? Okay, no, no, no. Oh, I can't even say it anyways. Oh, All right. yeah. Oh, yeah. Damn. Gosh. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I, um, no, I've been, I think I've been working on the accent for a while. I, you, um, I just don't feel good about it. Because I feel like sometimes it's like, oh, he's like, is, is he like from South London? And then sometimes like, like Wales. And then sometimes <laughs> it's like Australia. Liverpool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Sometimes so. you're on your Beatles ting. Yeah, but, exactly. So then, how well, how does it precipice? How how are you? Do you? I, I mean, we watch a lot of your videos. It seems like I, the reason that we like it is because it feels like ah, this is shit that happens to us. Is that how it always starts, or is yeah, it for sure? Yeah, yeah. I feel like I feel like you know Isaac and I would be like at the grocery store or something, and we hear something, and we're like, oh, let's film it right now. Okay. Oh, okay. Like, Boom. Oh, while right it's now. fresh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or we'll write it down. Um, I uh, I'll write it in my notes app, um, and 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 just like, or we'll come and you know, we'll write down, go home, and just like. Do you ever um, get nervous about being out in public? That's oh yeah, I don't my... like to film in public okay. <laughs> because like whenever we do it, we're always like, just put it on point five, lower the phone. Let's go, <laughs> oh, really? let's, go let's go. Really. <laughs> You try to be that incognito. So embarrassed. That's, yeah, I was about to say that's always the thing that I'm the most nervous about. I'm like, glad hey. you could be honest about that because I feel like I see so many people filming out in public. I'm like, damn, how no, do I that? can't do that. <laughs> one of our one of our favorites, I think, hopefully, we'll be able to put it up, is you making people feel dumb because of the things that they've said, mm. and that's definitely my parrot. Have you have you seen this one? Uh uh-uh. uh Wow, this place is awesome. I love the architect. <laughs> You uh, you know the architect? Hmm? You said you love them. Oh, no, I, like... Wait, did you mean architecture? <laughs> okay, because you said architect, which is the person. Okay, that's that's why it confused me. Sorry. <laughs> I get what you mean now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, we were just conversating and... Um... Did you say you guys were conversating? <laughs> is that a word? I don't remember that being a word. I guess it sounds weird <laughs> when I say because I... Cause I know the words converse, but I I know like it doesn't matter anymore. Like, I guess conversating could be a word. <laughs> I guess it's debatable. I don't know. It doesn't matter. I'm sure you're fine. I'm sure you're fine. I just remember like in fourth grade, like reading books. <laughs> I don't know. Yes. <laughs> I'm sure you're fine. But yeah, go on. Are you this type of person? Wow. Uh, internally, yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah. But the thing about, uh, I think that was both of us for real because Carlos really is that stupid. Um, <laughs> Like, like, Conversating, I have been though. Well, no, no, no. I mean, like, stupid in general, not even because of that. Because it's kind of, I think it's kind of a word now. I think, like, Miriam. We've conned it. Uh, or I coined added it. it. Miriam Webster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, so just my cousin Miriam. Just uh, <laughs> no, I think, like, it's been added now, technically, because there's, like, Gunna is now, you know. What is? I think Gunna? Like, Gunna? Like, I was gonna go. Yeah, oh, oh, I thought you said, like, oh, the rapper. Really? No. I was like, what is he no. doing in the, okay, the okay. literary world? That makes that. more sense. Yeah. So, um, so naturally, yeah, let's just the next, watch more of them. Imagine naturally, yeah. the next word would be conversating, gonna, and then conversating. Yeah, yeah. What about ideating? Have you have you been? I, I been, say ideating. I was about to say it yeah. sounds more. It ideating. sounds more fancy than brainstorming. I love when. Uh, yeah, yeah. Let, let, we'll, we can just ideate offline about it. Yeah, just like I love. I love learning a word. Like the first time I used like juxtaposition. Oh, I would. I said it oh. all day that day. I was like, oh, it feels like a juxtaposition. <laughs> They're you like, if that's actually wow, not- this is really juxtaposed. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I'm like, I'm so smart. I'm using all of my <laughs> AP English terminology. I that can word. definitely tell when Jacob has learned a new phrase <laughs> or a new oh, word. Oh yeah, I totally because, use it all the time. Yeah. Oh man, I'm so irate right now. God. Oh, it's really. He's weird. like, uh, you're walking on, you're walking on thin ice. <laughs> <laughs> Did you just learn what this phrase means? Did you? <laughs> He's always like, yeah. Turn an inch into a mile. <laughs> like, oh, he's just read a, get a mountain out of that molehill, daily, huh? <laughs> daily stoicism. Um, <laughs> you're our, I want to say our our first. Um, actually, screw all that. What happens? It looks like TikTok is staying around. Mm. It's here to stay. People, you know, for the first, like, right when it was coming up over the pandemic, it was like, ah, I don't know. Panic. Is it just going to be one of those? We've seen a bunch of social medias come and go. What do you, what happens if, if TikTok is no longer? What do you want to do? Oh, I've thought, I'm going back to school next semester. Oh, no way. Because um, I, I want to I wanna get, I want to study psychology. So, like, that, I've been thinking about that because I was like, okay. well, what if it, if it does go away? I'm like, Let's just go. I can take another ten years to get a degree, and um, yeah, I, I've been thinking about that. I also kind of want to like open a business. I want to have like okay. some business and stuff, you know. What, what type of business stuff do you want to do? You know what? Like I've thought about like having. Um, I, I thought about having like some little like like a like a like a little restaurant type of thing, like a like a, either like a kiosk, one of those like center uh -uh. places, yeah, yeah. or like a little food trailer type type thing. Okay, truck, like, food truck, like, but like a trailer. Oh, like, you know, like the ones that come, go in the back behind the truck? Mm -hmm. And it's just like a little one that you mm -hmm. step. Thank you guys for understanding because yeah. this is so wait, new wait. to them. There, <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, yeah. I, I'm confused. I love that he was like, Shrek. I'm, yeah, I'm, <laughs> yeah toxic, your toxic trait. Just that, yeah, he just yeah, did yeah, it. He just did it. Oh, you <laughs> did mean the food trucks? Yeah, 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 yeah sorry. Food continue. trailer? Yeah, He's, that's a thing. Yeah. What are we selling on the food trailer? Oh, yeah. I want to do asada fries. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. I want. I want to do something that's very simple. That can't be like personalized too much. <laughs> you know, I'm just like, no, we don't do that. Like, just have like three things. Like, this is like the perfect after high school. Like, when I was in school, we had Tosti Locos. We had, oh. you have, have you had Tosti Locos before? I don't like them, but no? go on. They're, it's definitely, I didn't, I had them sparingly. Have you had them before, Jacob? <laughs> <laughs> I just love when he goes, Oh, that's cool. Fuck those, but go off. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. No, talk your shit. I just thought that was so funny. Um, Takis with nacho cheese, bro. I don't know if you could. You, that's like your worst with nightmare. Yeah, it's you, horrible. He can't do Takis because they're a little too spicy and sweat. he's lactose yeah, I saw you sweating earlier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do. I love the taste of Takis, but yeah. And I'm also very lactose intolerant. If I ate that nacho cheese, oh no, I'd probably explode. You. But you know what? Well, are you going to put cheese on your fries? Yeah. Do you? That's are you gonna do it without cheese? Just dry, just like raw. Yeah, what do you just want? Ground beef over your fucking fries, bro? Well, I disgusting. can't have the condiment that he's putting on. We can put like lucerne. What is that? Like lucerne? What is, what is that? Oh, lucerne uh, bake, bake, lactate yeah. cheese? Oh, like, yeah, like something like that. We could do that if you want. Tofurky if you don't want the beef. Vegan either, bro. cheese, yeah. Daya. If you don't want the, yeah. I want beef, beef. It would be a salad too, not ground beef. It would be a salad. See, that's fine. Well, I that's mean, not dry. but it's already dry. You're saying you're saying it was dry. I figured we were just going full dry. Not be that dry. All right, not cool. That dry. Like there will still be pico de gallo and stuff. Pico? Wait, you're yeah. adding pico? 
Yeah. I love Pico. <laughs> I love Pico. That's my favorite. Do you actually have Pico? Can I get some, please? Uh, like, I have. I ha- It has stumped me what Spanish would sound like with the… I saw that. Where it was oh, like, yeah. What would… Oh, Spanish with a British accent sound like? Yeah. All the British people just totally one up to us and were like… Just speaking like, like just speaking Spanish. It just… It didn't have a British accent to it. Uh, I love when British people make fun of Americans. When they're like, water. Let's go get some water. <laughs> and I'm like, that we don't sound like that. I'm like, what? we don't sound like that. <laughs> we, we don't. We don't sound like that. Wait, who was that? Who would you sound exactly like? What? We don't sound like that. What? Wait, who is that? That's Tom Holland. I was like, well, well, no. No. I was like, no. <laughs> no. Not who I was thinking. No. <laughs> is that Adele? Is that Adele? I don't know. I, don't I know. love it. I love it when Adele's hot. She's a lot. Um, James Corden. What? No, not him. Uh, what is it? What did uh, when they're like? What's the album album about? She's like divorce, babe, divorce. No, <laughs> oh, I haven't seen that. I love. She, I love how blunt. British people like sound so cool, and then when they sing, they sound American. Yeah, I, I don't understand that. that. Well, I don't know because I'm thinking Ed Sheeran does say when your legs don't work. No, he does. He he's like the only one that sounds like. No, like, I, I, you know who the kooks are? Mm-mm. The kooks? They're, all right. uh, they're, they're, a, they're a British band and they sound uh, so British when they sing. Oh. But that's their thing. That's their… I feel like well, they… The area they of London… Up. Yeah, maybe the, the area of London that they're from. They're like… It's just harder. You can't take… In Birmingham. I don't Birmingham. know where they're from. I don't know. Yeah. You can't take the man just out the man. <laughs> <laughs> God, you know what sucks is I feel like that's actually a phrase. I feel like that's something they say. No, the phrases in Manchester are much more violent than that. I was leaving. Mm-hmm. I was leaving a, a next to a stadium in Manchester, and the cheers were literally like, "We're going to kill Brixton." It was like <laughs> they're, they're, and I think they we lost that game. We fucked your too. mother. Yeah. Whoa. That's no. That was that's like an Xbox. That's like an Xbox chant right there. Really. Yeah. I feel like I heard that in Liverpool City. Um, <laughs> Monica and Jordan. Yurt. Mm-hmm. What do y'all… <laughs> brought back Yurt. I don't have, my, I don't have my, my notepad on me today. Can y'all… Thank you so much. I don't know why I pulled my phone out so good. Can, can we liaison to the the producer Seggy Weggy? Yeah. Alright. So some quick real quick topics before we go into the game. <laughs> Let's do it. This is going to come out right before Halloween. Okay. Um, but since we're not in costume or anything. But let's talk a little bit about… What are some moments y'all have ghosted somebody or been ghosted? Since it's the spooky you season. Ghosting? Ooh, you ghosting? Welcome to spooky season. Are you segments? a ghoster? Yeah, I want to know. Am I a ghoster? Are you yeah. a ghoster? Bro? No, I'm not. No. no I don't really why? talk to people online. So I feel like that. No. I've never run into that. No. I'm just happy to have anybody talk to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, actually, I have I ghosted someone once. Yeah. For it, happened reason? Re- it happened recently. I met someone at a… Or no, I didn't even… Sorry, I'm going to go back. I went to a premiere. Okay. A while ago. <laughs> Pre-strike. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hey, just want to put that out there. All right. Um, and then I'm on my Instagram. I look at my DMs. And I have a DM from someone who I do not know, but they have a check mark. And I was like, oh, okay. Okay. And they were like, oh, we were at the same premiere. How did we not run into each other? I was like, oh, I don't know. This is, okay, cool. And then she was like, oh, where are you from? Where do you live? And I was like, oh, I live in, I live near Claremont, Pomona area, way too far from you. She's like, oh, I heard there's a cool arcade bar there. We should go. And I just didn't respond. Wow. Dang. Wow. Why? It, so convenient. You you would have had to go just blocks down. Yeah. Wow. All right. Felt weird. So now we know. Hey, don't be doing too much, love. All right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> don't be doing all that. It's a little too much. I mean, you're going to drive all the way out to Clermont. That's like an hour 45 for you. you yeah, doing? I don't know if I'm a ghoster, but I'm probably just a poor texter. Just a regular. Yeah, yeah just a regular poor texter. I, uh, yeah, I don't have much reasons to ghost. I think… I've probably been ghosted more than… Oh, really? Yeah. When was the last time you've been ghosted? The last time I was ghosted? I mean, there's definitely… I will, it, the, the thing that happens more often than not than ghosting is kind of just like… Sometimes you'll see someone out and about. And then I'll go and be like… And then I'll do what you just did. 
hit the DMs and be like, oh, it was nice to see you. Oh, we should hang out again. Or anything, right? Yeah, yeah. And then it'll be like one response and I just always take it one response too long. I'm always, I'm always the one like sending the last message oh. to be like, oh, okay, yeah, that's not getting a response, bro. Oh. <laughs> I'm always trying to say something too silly at the end. Damn. So yeah, I'm, I'm getting… To try different. to elicit another response? Yeah, I'm like trying to be spicy. Mm. Have you ever been on a dating app? No. No? No. no. <laughs> this guy fucks, bro. He doesn't need a dating app. No, <laughs> <laughs> no I don't. I don't need that. Uh, I just have… No, I'm just kidding. No, I no, not at all. It's not your vibe or… No, because I'm like… Is part I, of you scared I'm that people scared. are going to be like… This uh, is the guy from… I'm scared. <laughs> I don't like that either. I don't like that idea. I, of, I think like there was this, there was one time that I… um. <sighs> oh shit! Tell it. I was in Nevada. <laughs> I don't know. Fuck it. Uh, and and I was just like, mm, I'm bored. Okay. You know. And I was like, I think I had went for like one of my buddies' birthdays or something. And then I was like, I want my fly back to LA in the morning. Okay. You know. And so I was like, mm. Yo, where my Fresno? <laughs> <Where's> <laughs> no, my- no. <laughs> And then I'm, and then I'm just like, aren't you the guy from TikTok? Delete. Oh, because like, it's just uh, it's awkward. Yeah, it was yeah. that. Yeah, you got it once, and it happened. And that was, and that was it. I was like, I can't Damn. do this anymore. Yeah, like, that's, I can't that's... It. it's a, it's such a vulnerable feeling because yeah. I'm like, I just wanted, <laughs> like, I just wanted to go. Um, I just want a fucking peace. Whoa, no, I was just trying whoa. To I just, I'm just trying to find out. love. That's what just, like genuine what... love in Reno, Nevada. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. That's where they say you they, you find love is in Reno. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I've heard that. Yeah. I've said that. <laughs> Many times. <laughs> yeah, so no, I don't do that. Especially like… Um, well, because Lex, you're on a… What's that celebrity one? Whoa! Oh my gosh! Damn! <laughs> Yo, you're just out of here like that? Oh my gosh! Yeah. It's because I need my references for that one. Whoa. All right, pull up the Raya account. Oh my Do it goodness. right now. <laughs> We're going to rate it. Yeah. I can't lie at all on those things. Like, I feel like I just… I think that's why I don't get anywhere because I'm just being honest from the fr- from the jump. I'm like, yeah, two inches. You know, just like <laughs> straight up from the front. Like, yeah. From the back. From the top. From that <laughs> make it drop bottom. <laughs> Do you? I like I like listening to. I see on Hinge they have like the prompts and stuff like that. Oh, and you can speak them. I love oh. hearing. I love hearing the prompts that are like, "Tell us the most." You know, you you get definitely a sense of who they a person are. is. Where they're like, "Tell us the most embarrassing thing about you," and they're like, "Um, I just I work out too much probably." <laughs> oh yeah. Like, um, I'm just like so dedicated. That's my down. That's my con. I um, it's called hinge. I think yeah, I think so. And so anybody can hear it or something. Nah. So it's basically like instead of instead of going on Tinder where it's just like photo where you're just showing like a photo highlight reel. There's like a photo highlight reel, and then on top of that, there's like tell us your favorite movie or. But most of the time, it's just poor you excuses. A, you can like upload a voice memo onto your account. Do people have to like? Do you match first, or is it just like a for you page? I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I'm not, I'm oh, not okay. on it. I think you do match. I think it's just oh, like okay. a regular dating app. Okay. Oh exactly. my! Whoa! You're gonna you're gonna take that from him, bro? Oh, you're gonna let him do that to you? <laughs> what? Just a regular dating app, fool. Just regular, dude. No, I like to go outside. I like to go to like a coffee place mm. and just try to be like, bump into someone naturally. Just spill your coffee. Just spill your hot coffee on something. chai. Are you more of a chai person? I'm a chai person yeah. too. We talked about that. I don't like coffee. Yeah. And I hear it doesn't actually make you more energized. Right. It just dampens your like… Uh, I want to say it's like a… Like melatonin sleepy stuff? Yeah. Like you have a caffeine receptor we'll call it. Mm-hmm. And it lowers the threshold so that you can… So that you're not getting fatigued. It basically just like builds up the fatigue that you can handle. Versus actually allowing you to get oh, more energy. That's interesting. So if you're drinking coffee out there, you're building tolerance to fatigue, not waking up. And you're just annoying for saying you yeah. need it. That's what I'm saying. I do think it's a funny sentence. People are like, oh, don't talk to me until I've had my coffee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, oh, I need it. Sorry. It's <laughs> a very millennial thing to say. I don't know. I can't even have coffee. The the it's I feel so lame, but it the acidity just hurts my tummy. <laughs> that's, that's like so, the a lot of things hurt your tummy though. What? A lot of things seem to hurt your tummy. Well, yeah, I have, I have a little sensitive tummy. What's well, just dairy, but sense of tummy? Have you dairy ever, and acidity. It's man. always like hot people have stomach problems. 
That's what I hear. Dude. Hot girls have IBS. Let's yeah. freaking go out there. IBS. Kick it. I just got a haircut in Echo Park. That's, a, yeah. that's so extreme. What? IBS? IBS? Yeah. I do know a couple girls have IBS. There's even billboards for it. Really? Mm -hmm. Hot girls at IBS? Hot girls have IBS. It's in uh, Huntington Beach. There's a giant billboard for it. And but what does it say? Oh, that's it. That's all it says. Yeah, that's all. That's it. Oh, it's just that's an observation, easy. not a promo, not a PSA. That's I think it. maybe they're trying to normalize oh. IBS. Yeah. So like people can see it and be like, I'm not alone. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> all of the hot white girls in Huntington Beach, they're like, oh yes. Pulling over on the side of the road to crap their pants. Apparently, like, <laughs> <laughs> dude, yeah. there's a porta potty right underneath the freaking sign. Have you seen those porta potties overseas that? Are clear when you're not using them, but like the windows, oh, you the windows. That? Yeah, it's basically like it's it's like a chameleon, like a color yeah, changing. Totally, it's like it's it. clear. Yeah, you can I don't see like the toilet. That and then you walk in, and then the walls. Like, I'd be so sketched out to be like, what if they change, and you're just there, like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's opening up. And you're like. <laughs> like super I I couldn't. That's too much. That's too I much. I like. I got uh, goosebumps. I like. Yeah. I got goosebumps when you said that. Okay. On the real though, if you guys ever wiped and then there's just nothing there. Oh, that right. Is, You're saying first time. That that's unsettling. What do you mean? No, it's normal. It, like it's great. It feels so good. Yeah, it's the best like, feeling you ever. Feel, I'm like, oh, I'm ready to bottom. I'm like, you're like very just like clean. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Like, let's go to Pomona right now. We're going to 340 <laughs> right now. Like 340, where the fuck you at? <laughs> I used to get the Uber. I'm going to 340 right now. It's ready. <laughs> I'm ready. Dude, we got to take you to 340, actually. Shout out 340 in Pomona. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> they're not watching. Yeah, they're, they're dancing right now. They're, they're, they're dancing, dancing in cages, true. as, I, as mm -hmm. I understand. That's the only and place I've cool ever been And then it's cool because it has a… Um, Upstairs is like reggaeton. Mm -hmm. Downstairs is like oh, pop, yeah. like Britney mm -hmm. type shit. Mm -hmm. And then there's like, I think there's three rooms. There's yeah, there's three. a back. Right? Room. There's yeah. a back. There's a back. And then that was like paisa, mm -hmm. like very like paisa. Okay. And and then you go upstairs and it's like all bad bunny. Like, like it was so fun. Okay. So the upstairs one like, has the cages. Okay. Yeah. The upstairs one is very, it's like, it's that's good. where it's at. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then I go down and check on like my cousins downstairs. The, at the at the Mexican one, the Mexican one, yeah. For context, we're talking about where three forty in Pomona. Pomona, because yeah. before I think it was before the pod we were talking about oh, Pomona. Oh so. yeah, yeah. And then next door is Carnaval. Yeah, which is I haven't been to that one. That one is that straight. straight. That one's just like a normal um, like Mexican like banda music there. Have you guys been to the one that it's uh, across the street from three forty and then like a block down? I think no, it's, it's, like a, it's like an Irish pub, but the it's a it's a, in a basement. Mm -mm. You been in that one? That one's pretty good. They have a disco ball. It's pretty fun. Oh, um, yes, it. You know what I'm talking about called. Hold on. Is there? There's like a jazz. You when you walk in the first floor to the left is like a jazz. Yes, and then thing. downstairs it's. Uh, yeah, I've done stuff. Irish actually. <laughs> Dang. I mean, it's an Irish. Yes, Irish pub. It is right. It's yeah, off of, it's off of Gary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah the scene in Pomona yeah. is pretty. It's pretty cool. Diverse. We Pomona. should do a uh, Lone Lobos. 340 run. That'd be fun. You guys can all crash in my grandma's house. Can I go? O'Donovan's. Yeah, yes, of course. Yeah, of course. O'Donovan's. Huh? O'Donovan's. O'Donovan's, yeah. O'Donovan's is sweet. I like O'Donovan's. <laughs> this podcast is brought to you by yeah, the Pomona podcast. Tourism Industry. This, yeah. Yeah, this, <laughs> Pomona Chamber and Ancestry.com. Check out Mi Cafecito. Brought to you by coffee, Diarrhea. <laughs> <not the> coffee, <laughs> check out Three Big Games. Check out <laughs> DBA 256. What, what, what else in Pomona? There's Bro. a hookah lounge right next door, right? To like right in the corner of Carnaval and stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Are you into hookah? Mm, I yeah, like no, but like I want to be. You know, <laughs> it looks cool, and then I do it, and it I'm like, cool. wait, this feels like nothing. Right. Oh, you done it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think well, for me, I'm always just like really drunk when I go mm -hmm. in there. So for me, I'm, I don't even know if I'm even doing it right. I just like the oh, feeling. You're of like the I'm just there. I just yeah, like feeling because like I think up. I'm like in front of Uber, and then they're like, you want a table, and I'm like, yeah, and and then I like do it. I don't even know how to do it. I forgot. Yeah, I haven't. I haven't been there in a year. So, well, the sound, now we're talking about. We're going this weekend. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah, we can have a a little. Yeah, we can have a little spooky night. Spooky night. You Pomona. dressing up for anything for Halloween? We've been thinking. We've we've been trying to. <sighs> I've been we've been ideating too. I was I was thinking. Um, do you know El Chavo del Ocho? Of course. Do you know like Ñoño? Yeah. 
I want to be Nyo Nyo. <laughs> can, can we pull a picture? Yeah. I need to see this. <laughs> I have no context on what this is, so I need to see what How the heck do you spell it? Just put no no. With two Enyas or? It has an Enya, yeah, but you know. Wow, it was the first result. Oh, oh my God. Yeah. I would look good. so cute. That is cute. All right. And like I'm growing my hair out for that. Just have you know, the bangs. <laughs> I, 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 to be fair, I was Nyo Nyo like 10 years ago and just like the response. Oh, you're bringing it back. What does he sound like? I think he was kind of like high pitched. I don't remember. I haven't watched it in a long time. But yeah, I think he was high pitched. I remember uh, my, my, uh, my bosses at the time, they made, um, <laughs> yeah. they made me, they made me the, the outfit. Like they stitched it themselves. Oh, what? That was the only good thing they ever did for you, bro. Yeah, yeah. After that, um, didn't go well. But it but it was, I look, so, the response was electric. I just, people were like, you're him. And I was like, you walked into the room, just commanded attention. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, and at that time, I had to put like pillows and stuff. I don't need that anymore um, for the outfit. So, um, I don't know. These, they has, he's bulbous. He's definitely got. I know what I think you'll need is to go on your knees. I like the okay. proportions. Yeah, are, I can do that. I like those. I like it when people have the outfits where they go on their knees and they have the shoes. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. You know what I'm talking about where they look. Yeah. Or I mean, yeah, whatever. Cualquiera, whatever. I just want to look cuddly. All right. Um. We are. Yeah. Let's 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 wrap up up. Yeah. We do have this last tiny little segment that yes. we do. It's called Song of the Week. Yes. Oh, that's so, right. I even think one. we're each going to go around and we're going to say, what's our song of the week? And you can mm. go ahead and feel free and sing a little verse or two if you'd like. Mm. A whole sure. verse. A whole, so, okay. a whole stanza. Do you have one in mind? Um, a song of the week. Um, yeah. Yes. Whatever you're feeling. Um, Despacito, Daddy Yankee. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's my song of All the right. week. All right. You know why? Because. Why? Tell us. Because a lot of my music right now is tainted. Oh, um, by because of of uh, someone that was attached to those music, those songs. Oh, okay. So I have to change up the playlist. Damn, damn. So despacito, okay, is what I'm gonna go with. Do you want to give us? My, do you care to? We usually like to give a little three to five second, just in case oh, anyone hasn't. Yeah. <laughs> um. <laughs> yeah, I'll do Daddy Yankee's part. Uh. Did that. Si te pido un beso, ven dámelo. Yo sé de que estás besándolo. Llevo tiempo intentándolo. Mami, estoy dándolo. Sabe que tu corazón conmigo se hace para, para. Sabe que sabe, va a estar buscando de mí. Ven, prueba de mi boca para ver cómo te sabe. Right. Quiero, whoa, quiero, whoa, quiero, whoa, quiero whoa, con whoa, todo. Whoa. Wait a second. Yo no tengo prisa, yo me quiero dar el viaje. Empezamos lento, después salvaje. Pasito, pasito. <laughs> sabe, <laughs> sabe, <laughs> sí. That's, All right. Well, now we're going to get part. a copyright strike because you did that so well. It sound, it's me. For everybody listening, it's still <laughs> Leo. It's Leo. It wasn't the guy. And you, Jacob? Dude, I can't think of one. I'm drawing a blank. Come back to team. Me. Back to me. All right. Um, uh, my song of the week is Becky G's Baile Con Mi Ex. Mm. I hadn't heard that song before and I heard it at the concert yesterday. It's fire. Mm. It's a bop. It's, it's, a, it's defo bop. And I don't, I don't know the words so I couldn't do it but I could hum in it. I could hum it. Oh, actually the, the chorus is Baile Con Mi Ex para tara 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 otra vez. Oh, we have to know the words. That's yeah, weird. that's it. That's all I got. Team, <laughs> you got yours? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go with Soy Peor remix, Ooh. Bad Bunny, oh. J Valerie No Suna. You know this one? <laughs> oh, you know this one? It's because I just revisited all his trap music like two days ago after the album. Yeah, oh my gosh, okay, go. And he's like, <laughs> he's like all mood, and he's like, oh. Sigue tu camino, que sin ti me va mejor. Ahora tengo otra que me lo hace mejor. And I'm not going to say the rest. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, hey, Monica. All right, Jordan. You know, the, the funny thing is, I, had a, I have an artist that sent me her album. Oh, and she's okay. like, oh, can you check out my album? Okay. Uh, her name is Zay, and she's from, um, like, Boy Heights, East LA area. No way. Okay. And a song that I chose is Mangoes and Limes. Okay. But I don't remember it. 
Okay, that's fine. It. That was such a good re- rendition of Daddy Yankee that it wiped her song out of my head. So oh, damn. Okay. Sorry about but that. But maybe in post, I'll add me me humming it like right now. <laughs> <laughs> but my song of the week, Zay, Mangles and Limes. Mangles and Limes. Yeah. Shout out Zay. Shout out, shout out East LA. Are you, you Jacob? All right, I got one. I'm seeing underscores in concert. Radis's episode is coming out. Uh, so my song is Bozo 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 by underscores on their Fishmonger album. It's my favorite album by them. What type of music is fishmongering music? Um, no, Fishmonger is the name of the album. It's like it's it's like hyper pop. I do not take you for a hyper pop type of person. I only like this one album oh, okay. of hyper pop. I haven't really listened to any other. Or I've listened to a couple of other albums by different artists. This is the only one I like. Well, you heard it here first, gang. Yeah. Jacob is your Buzzle, hyper pop. Buzzle, Buzzle, you're an idiot. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Wait, is that, is, is that the how it goes? Or are you just interrupting? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that's how it goes. We just interrupt yeah, yeah. each other to say that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's oh. how it goes. Oh. <laughs> all right. Wow. Well, we'll wrap it up there. Thank you all so much. That was the song of the week. This was Yo Gonzalez. And this was our 23rd episode. I'm Sholo Mari Duena. Thank you so much. Joined by Jacob Scott Thomas Best Holmes. Thanks, y'all. Woo-hoo. Wait, wait, wait. Actually, I'm tripping. This is like the fifth wait. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Leo, is there, for all the people who have just met you for the first time on the Lone Lobos mm-hmm. podcast, where can we find you? Oh, true. Oh, um, yeah, on Instagram, uh, only uh, um, <laughs> TikTok, and uh, yeah, everywhere. Which everywhere. Uh, Leo Gonzal. We'll put Gonzalez it out. Was It'll be right here <laughs> over my eyes. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Go over my eyes right here. Yeah. Stop demanding graphics in weird places. <laughs> <laughs> I'm putting an end to this. Right here. Right here. It's going to be at the bottom of the screen. We love it. <laughs> love it, y'all. Well, we have a Reddit. Check us out. We have the IG. We got it all. You Thanks, too. y'all. Woo-hoo. This episode of Lone Lobos is a Lone Lobos production produced by Monica Tamayo and JMKM with intro music by Nicholas Gray. Like what you hear? Check us out on Instagram at Lone Lobos.